want a seamless cruiser like this then watch this video till the end hello everyone how are you all hi guys it's me ria and welcome to my youtube channel first of all i want to thank you all for giving so much love to my previous digital scrapbook video and if you guys have like a lot of questions that's why i made this video in detail so that all your questions get answered so without wasting any time let's go select this plus sign button here you will see custom size option now here's the trick as you know instagram cruiser size is 1080 pixel so the height will always be that but the width hoga will depend karega on the number of slides you want in your instagram post for an example agar aapko 4 slides chahiye ek instagram post pe to aap width mein 1080 ko 4 se multiply karke daloge aur height hamesha utna hi rahega and this is how your cruiser will look like now select three dots option select setting add guides and then select on custom in the column option put the number of slides you want in your instagram post gap will be zero and the margin will be zero the line represents one slide in the post so firstly add pictures now go to elements option so that we can start editing first search photo frame select the first option you can add your picture in this photo frame and place it however you feel like then search tape you will get plenty of options to choose from but don't select the pro one You can add letters on your picture. It looks cute, right? You can search cute and you'll get this cute graphics to choose from. You can add it on your picture using your creativity. You can also draw on your picture by using this draw option. Choose the marker, choose the color and draw. Then search ripple paper. Choose any one. You can use it to divide the slide. And this is what it look like. Now if you want to add a cut out picture of yours you can do that in Canva because the background remover is paid so use InShot app add your picture select cut out option select cut out and your background will be removed you can also outline your picture and then save it now go back to Canva add your picture that you just saved you can also outline in canva by using this corner option you can change color according to your choice you can also add text and after all the editing this is how it looked like and now save it it will be save in your gallery now go to chrome and search split image here we'll split the scrapbook into slides so that we can post on instagram select this website in choose file option select the picture that you just saved in canva choose horizontally in quantity of blocks add the number of slides and then click on split image now you have to download the picture one by one and it will be saved in a gallery so now we will post on instagram here select this multiple option and start selecting your picture one by one Select it in the same way that you have made in Canva and see how seamless it looks like. 
so now we're gonna post it i hope this video is helpful and if it is then don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more bye